People in Pinellas County are banding together to catch a brazen thief who stole a trailer belonging to a family business. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan and I'm Paula Grone. Jamison Euler has the night off tonight. Our Sarah Hollenbeck is live in St. Petersburg and Sarah, these thieves actually took this trailer full of expensive irrigation equipment from a church parking lot. Yeah, and the strange thing is this is an extremely well lit parking lot and just take a look at this street over here. This is four lanes of traffic here on 62nd Avenue North. That's why the owner of the irrigation company says he felt pretty good leaving his stuff here for the past three years. It definitely took took me by surprise when I went there and it was not there. John Farber's heart sunk his trailer gone from this church parking lot without a trace. It was everything. Um, it has everything we use on the job. Um, so it's it, we're starting from scratch. Farber suspects the thief cut through heavy locks on the trailer using bolt cutters. He immediately posted on Facebook asking people to be on the lookout. Within hours, hundreds vouched to help. Sending prayers, sending thoughts, and so that's meant a lot. The bold crime tossed his family-owned business into a tailspin. We had to uh, pull from everywhere, go rent some tools, buy tools, borrow tools. But today they're back on the job at USF St. Pete's campus. We were pulling from all directions. Uh, it was it was literally yesterday and we we're supposed to be on the job today. The thief may have made off with 10 grand in equipment, but the Christmas crook couldn't swindle the single dad's positive outlook. Count our blessings and keep on going. And with his son Jackson's support. We said a prayer about it and uh, he said, Daddy, it'll be OK. He's even mustered up the courage to forgive the thief. To be honest, I wish the best for him. You know, if he if he needed that or they needed that this bad, then uh, you know, I'm really sorry for them. And with an attitude that good, we want to make sure he gets that trailer back. So here's what you want to know. It is white with silver trim. The license number is 4280PL. It's 12 feet long, a single axle, and has scratches on both sides on the back of the trailer. Now, if you do see it, we're urging everyone to call St. Pete Police. Reporting live in St. Pete, I'm Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News.